It's an outing many kids will remember all their lives. Their field trip to Maple Hill Cemetery. Isn't that beautiful? Huntsvillian John Risen Jones never got to tour Maple Hill as a youngster, but he can certainly give tours today. He's co-authored a book that will help anyone get around the oldest and most interesting section of Maple Hill. This is Thomas Bibb, the second governor of Alabama's grave, right here, the tall obelisk. While modern day markers are in the Maple Hill computer, the oldest section never was recorded until now. We tried to single out the more notable people who are buried here to give a little, you know, one or two sentences about them. Mm -hmm. Because unless we do that now, those of us who remember, the next generation probably is not going to know. The book tells about five Alabama governors buried here, the president of a national car company, the man who some say started the war between the states, even a world championship wrestler. But one of the more this interesting finds come. came not inside Maple Hill, Hill, but with the street alongside Maple Hill. For a century or more, folks have wondered why California Street was so Here named. A map well, an Maple old Hill. map showed the answer was again. in the year California Street this was created. And the year was 1849, the gold rush. So that's how Huntsville has a California Street. We find that fascinating because we really didn't know. Each year, 100,000 people come through Huntsville searching for their own answers to their Alabama roots. Thanks to the new Maple Hill book, that search just got easier. What we Dick Curtis at Large, New Center 19. As you look at Huntsville. the meridian marker here, from here to Wells Avenue is the original cemetery. And then this next area.